This is a quick Cricut design tutorial where I'm going to show you guys how to create this glitter text for you to use on your print and cut projects. We're using the slice tool in this tutorial which I've used in some of my previous tutorials in the past. For starters you do need to download glitter digital paper which you can find on places like Etsy or creativemarket.com available for purchase for instant download. And there are other websites like pexels.com where you can find free images to use in your projects. This particular set of digital paper I bought on Etsy and it was something like 42 total papers for like $2. So I'm going to leave the link for that down below if you're interested. So the first step is to upload your glitter paper to the Cricut Design Space. Click on complex and continue. Apply and continue. Then you're going to select the print then cut image option here on the right side and hit upload. Now click add to canvas. This is a really large image so I'm going to resize it. First click up here on the lock button and I'm going to change the proportions to 6x6. Six six. Now go over to the text tool and I'm going to use one of my favorite fonts. It's called Birds of Paradise and you can find it on dafont.com but I'll leave a link for that down below as well. The last step is to select both the text layer and the glitter paper. So to do that, just drag your mouse to select both layers at once. And then go down here to slice. And now you can get rid of all the extra layers that we won't be using. And there is your glitter text and you can use this on invitations and labels. So essentially you have a glitter text element that you can add to any of your future print and cut projects. But in order to do that, you do need to flatten your image first. So let me show you. If I insert this label frame that I uploaded earlier, resize it and go up here to arrange and set to back so that the text is on top of the label. If you want this to print together as one image and not as two separate images, you have to select both layers and go down here to flatten. And now your label is ready to print. You can resize it and duplicate this to fit a couple of labels per sheet. Then go to make it and there is your label with your glitter text ready to print and cut. If you're interested, I do have a video up in the right hand corner where I show you guys how I print and cut my sticker labels and what paper I use and all of that. This is what the design looks like once printed. That is it for this video. I hope you found this helpful. Let me know down below if you have any questions or comments and like and subscribe for future content.